was a kid, me and my daddy and my mama and our kitty kitty, we'd sit out here on this bench. I mean, we haven't used it in years, but we'd sit out here on this bench and we'd smoke our marijuana and drink some tea. By golly, that was some good times. But Antoine can't do that now, can he? Now, by tragic, tragic story of that woman taking his kid. Oh, 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 gee golly. But what did that man do? What did that hero do? Well, by God, he set up a GoFundMe and he moved from that awful place to living and left that child with his mama or her mama. Who cares anymore about gender, right? But that's not a bad thing because he's a hero. He knew what he was doing. He's a hero of the father man. See, I remember, I remember when I was a kid, we had a donkey and we would cut all of that together. All of it. All that brush. All for that donkey. It was good times, man. Me and my daddy would cut that shit. But Antoine's kid can't. But that's okay. Because my daddy was a piece of shit. And Antoine is not. Because he wasn't even there in the first place. <laughs> Now, see that right there? That's what I used to do when I grew up. You see, Tarkasaw just sits there and goes on and on and on about how he how he has a job and how how he has to fight the good fight against fink wrestling. Yeah, where I come from, man, we had to cut down them fucking trees just to just to burn ourselves some fucking wood in the winter. That's goddamn right. Now I just sit around and do fucking meth all the goddamn time in that shed right there. That's all that I do. I'm just a worthless piece of redneck shit. That's it. The Tonka man, he he the guy. He the guy. Yeah, he, you see, he he understands. He he understands what it's like to uh to to be a working man. He 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 gets it, man. He, that's his thing. Like he he's such a fucking hero. He's fucking hero, guys. You're just you're just a bunch of zeros. You see, you see where I used to cut this fucking wood, you know, just so just so I would survive. Donk and fake cut that wood. Excellently. He cut a promo about that wood. He cut a fucking promo about how fucking how how he fucking uh he karate chopped that fucking tree. He karate chopped that fucking tree and he fucking split into fucking little fucking pieces of wood because he's telling motherfucker. Goddamn right. Tonka, he, he a fucking hero. Yeah, man. When I was a kid, I used to love me a BW. I used to think they were the coolest thing. And I just sit out here and rot. Isn't that just sad? Sad, sad, sad. And now that we're talking about that, talking about, about sadness and despair, let's talk about Tonka Saul's three houses. I mean, let's talk about Tonka Saul's life. He wasn't always the hero that he is today. Nope. No, 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 no. Tonka Saw has a tragic story. Oh, gee golly. Man. His daddy. Oh, his daddy. You see, his daddy was the coolest guy ever. His daddy knew. His daddy knew. That Tonka Saw would grow up to be the greatest man that has ever lived to invade the internet. So what does his daddy do? What did Tonka Saw's daddy do? 
Talk to Saul's daddy. Took his finger and shoved it right up Talk to Saul's ass. I've already I've already started a relationship with a man and us broken up. <laughs>